What's going on everybody? It's the MMA card guy. I've got one big card for you guys to check out today. A little package, do not bend. So hopefully <laughs> um, this package was not bad. But we'll just get right into this. Um, this is one card I, I was waiting on this for a while. It was a pre-sale on eBay. I actually worked out a deal with the seller. Um, so it was listed at $275, but that is not what I paid for it. So I think I got this for $125, and I was happy to do so. But here we go, direct from Panini. We've got Ilya Toparaya, KO's Herbert in the second round. So this is from Panini Instant. This is actually... The first card that I have ever purchased of um, from Panini Instant. I don't necessarily go out and buy these, um, but this is a rookie card. Now, if you flip it to the back here, um, let me get this tape out of the way. Should I take this off? Maybe I won't take this off. But this is numbered. If you can see it, four of five right there. This is the Versicolor Parallel. So just a sweet looking card in general but big fan of this guy um just kind of just he reminds me of um charles jordan just in the way that he's just like aggressive forward pressure just like kind of gives you like a spartan warrior type vibe um so he had a huge win um last his last outing um it's hard to beat a rookie number to five. Granted, this isn't Prism or anything. So uh, this value as compared to a product like that won't be necessarily as high. Um, his Prism stuff right now is through the roof. And, you know, as more product is ripped, um, you know, more listings pop up, you know, that, that will come down a little bit. But a lot of his Prism, um, his base isn't too bad. I think it's like 15, 20 bucks. Maybe get it for cheap than that but um parallels are going for a lot right now so i saw this i thought it was cool um so glad i was able to work out the deal that i did <coughs> with the seller so panini instant versa color ilia topariah not sure if i'm saying the name right um numbered four out of five got high hopes for him whether he competes at featherweight or lightweight, you know, there's talks of him and Patty Pimblay, uh, you know, fighting at 155. So we'll see. But I was super happy to pick this up. I don't think I'm going to take that tape off just yet. Um, but thanks so much for watching this short video, guys. Hopefully you like this video. Let me know uh, what you guys think of him down below. If you aren't yet subscribed and feel so inclined, um, feel free to do so. That'd be greatly appreciated. If you have any, you know, comments, uh, you want to drop suggestions for future videos, um, shoot those down below as well. Uh, thanks so much for watching, guys. We'll see you in the next one.